welcome again to Ogongo TV. This is Medical Tips. Today, I want to talk to you about eight conditions of headache that I want you to be aware of. If you have not subscribed to this channel, Ogongo TV, please subscribe. Subscribe now. Click the notification bell and show me your support by liking and share. Thank you very much. Yes, eight conditions of headache I want you to be aware of. Of course, headache is a very common condition that many people will experience many times in their lifetimes. The main symptoms of headache is essentially pain in the head and the face, which could be thrombin, constant, dull, or sharp. Of course, headache could be treated with medications, stress management, and bowel feedbacks. There are more than 100 types of headache, but essentially they have been classified into two, primary headaches or secondary. Primary in the sense that it is not due to any other medical conditions. It could be cluster headache, migraine headache, or tension headache. And secondary headache because it is due to other diseased condition. But for the purpose of this discussion, I want to mention to you eight conditions of headaches that you should be aware of. Number one, a sudden new and severe headache. What I mean is, of course, you know the type of headache that you have been having. If you suddenly have a headache that you could say is different from the one you are used to, then that means it's a new type of headache for you. If it is sudden in onset, it just came suddenly and it is serious, it is severe, please don't waste time. See a doctor. Number two. Headaches that is associated with neurological symptoms like tiredness, loss of balance, like numbness and tingling sensations in your extremities, like sudden vision changes or seizure disorders, speech difficulties, all these neurological problems. Once you notice them in association with the headache that you have, please don't wait. See your doctor. Number three, headache that is associated with fever, neck stiffness, body rash, or shortness of breath. Listen again. You have headache now and you notice shortness of breath or body rash. Or you have fever with it, or there's neck stiffness, or you find all these in association with headache in your child, please don't wait. See your doctor. Number four, headaches that wake you up at night. If you have headache and you find it difficult to sleep, it means that the headache is severe. Please don't wait. See your doctor. Number five, headaches that is associated with nausea and or vomiting. You have not been vomiting before. You have not been feeling nauseated before. But suddenly this headache came and you are nauseated or you are vomiting. Then don't wait. See your doctor. Number six, Headaches that you notice after head trauma. The head trauma may not be much, but maybe you hit your head against hard objects like the floor, like the wall. Maybe you fell down suddenly and could not guide your head very well. And a few days later or one week later, you begin to have headache. Please don't wait. 
see your doctor. Number seven, when you have a new type of headache after the age of 55, I mean, of course, when you have headache, you understand that, oh, this is the kind of headache I've been having in the past. But this time around, this headache is different. You can feel it. You say, this is different from the headache I used to have. And you're 55 or above. Please don't wait. See a doctor. And number eight. When you have headache episodes for more than three times or up to three times in a week. Listen again. Three or more episodes of headaches in a week. Please don't wait. See your doctor. Well, I want you to listen again and again to these eight points because I believe that one day it's going to save somebody. It may not be you. It may be that person next to you. Listen again. Share this message. Like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. I want you to stay safe, stay healthy because health is wealth. This is Medical Tips. And my name is Dr. Moniye Adoye. I love you.